tired. So the activity that I find very helpful um, in helping readers become more fluent is actually uh, using the strategy of a picture walk. A picture walk helps students, it helps readers understand the stories they are reading and it helps to utilize pictures to help readers learn um, unfamiliar words. Like for instance, with this story that I chose here, The Very Hungry Caterpillar. Uh, first, with the picture walk, you will have to instruct the students to look at the cover. So for instance, we look at the cover and then I'll ask the student, what do you see on the cover of the book? Yes, a caterpillar. So on the cover of this book, it is a caterpillar. So because of the cover, we know the story is probably about a caterpillar. Next, we are going to go through each page and look for clues on our picture walk and try to see what the story is about. So now let's go to the first page. So I asked the students, what do you see? Then they're gonna like do some observations. It looks pretty dark. Uh, what do you see here, a moon? What do you see here? Uh, does it look, they'll, they'll probably mention that it looks dark outside, like the sky is dark. It looks like nighttime. They see a plant. They see a tree. Do you see something white here? So I'll keep going. What do you see here? We see a big bright sun. And look what we see here. We see a little caterpillar. It looks like the same caterpillar that we've seen on the front cover. Looks like a very happy little caterpillar. All right, so that's just like little ways that we can, students can look at the images and predict what is going on. Um, so with the picture walk, what we're doing is we are gathering important words to maximize our vocabulary. So we're pretty much reading the story with the picture walk. We're going through the story by using the pictures. And the final step would actually be when we actually read the story, where well, we have to read the actual words. So um, with the vocabulary that we gain from the picture walk, we will use that to help us when we come across words that we do not understand. So that's pretty much the whole point of um, a picture walk is to first look at the images and through those images, like for instance, like we know this is a leaf by looking at the image when we begin to read and we come across an unfamiliar word, like for instance, the word is here, a leaf, based on the vocabulary that we already, the vocabulary that we already, um, we utilized by going through every picture, we're gonna just match that with the, uh, with the word, the actual word. I hope this kind of makes sense. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.